In this video, I want to talk about subtracting integers. So as I uh, talked in the last video, we're going to use the algebra tiles. So I'm defining, or we are going to accept that this negative tile is negative one, and this green tile is positive one. Okay, so before I start, I hope you understand that negative one, negative one plus, plus one is equal to zero. That means you have a negative tile and a positive tile. They cancel each other out. So this is, a this is what it means in a diagram. So this is your negative one plus, plus this is your positive one. So this is, this is in a diagram. So this is negative one. That means it's a red tile and this is positive one. And if you have a negative and a positive tile, they cancel each other out and you get a zero. That's one thing uh, we are going to, we can understand or we are going to accept. Okay, so let's start with the first example. Okay, how would you do positive three, oh, plus four, take away plus three. Now this is very easy to understand. So you basically here, yeah, this, is, this is nothing but asking what is four take away three and most of you all, you should know this is one. But let's do this using the algebra tiles. So, so let me, so you got from four tile, so this is your four tile, from your four tile, this is one, two, three, four. So from four tile, you're taking away three tiles. Okay, that means you are canceling this tile, so you've got this is take away, and what is left is one. Okay, so this is pretty easy. So let me take one more example. Say if it is plus five, plus five, take away plus two. That means basically here you're asking the question, what is five take away two? And that is three. Okay, five take away three, two is three. So if you want to explain that in a diagram, you got five tiles. 5, 1, 2, 3, uh, three 4, 5. So this is plus 5, and you're taking away two tiles. So you're taking away two tiles. So what is remaining is 3. This is easy, but what happens? So let me cancel it. I want to use these tiles. I want to cancel it. Okay, now. This is where the problem uh, happens. What if you have negative two, negative two take away positive four. Now you have negative two tiles. So let me, if you want to do this as a diagram, so how will you do it? So you've got two negative, this is negative two in a diagram or in a picture. This is what this negative two means. Now from this, you cannot take away four tiles, four green tiles. So it's difficult to understand visually here. Yeah. So yeah, what I was saying is, as I explained in one of my previous video, this means taking away, taking away means you can write this as an addition. So this is same as ask, asking the question, what is negative two plus negative four? If you change this operation of minus to plus, you have to change the number that comes after the operation, which is plus four to negative four, okay? You change the operation and you change the number. You change the number that comes after the operation. So this is the operation plus, I want to write as negative. Or my, sorry, from negative, I want to change this into positive sorry, from minus, I want to change this into plus, or from subtraction, I want to change this into addition. So this and this are one and the same. So here you're asking the question, what is negative two plus negative four? So this, if you want to write, show a diagram, so here you're asking what is negative two, so you got, this is what it means. This is negative two plus, negative four. So you've got one, 
two, three, four. I'll show this on a calculator. So this is negative four. This is what it means, negative two plus negative four. That means that is negative six. You got six red tiles, which stands for negative six. So let me show this on a calculator. This is a simple, or uh, this is a graphic calculator. So let me show you. So this and this are the same. So let me go to menu and run. So first we said negative two, or this is minus two. Okay, let me, yeah, minus two or negative two, take away. You can use the same sign, plus four. Let me scroll this slightly up. Oops. I want to see the equal to sign equals negative six. Or if you go negative two plus negative four, oops, I want to go negative two plus negative four equal negative six. Okay, so let me again cancel this whole thing. Okay, the next question. How would you explain negative five take away plus two? Okay, so let's start with negative five. So you've got five negative tiles. Five negative tiles, so this is negative five. Now from these five negative tiles, you can't take away two green tiles, it's impossible. So yeah, how are we going to explain this? So we, well, you can't take away two green tiles from five red tiles, but I can change this negative to a positive. So, well, this is the same as writing negative to five plus, when you change this operation of minus to plus, you have to change the number that comes after the operation to the opposite number. So the opposite number of plus two is negative two. Now you can add negative five plus negative two. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to write, bring two red tiles. You can add, this is negative five, this is plus, I want to add negative two. So negative five plus negative two, you've got seven lots of red tiles, which is negative seven. Okay, so let's use a calculator. First, let's understand this. Negative five take away plus two equals negative seven. Or if you go negative five plus minus two or negative two is also minus seven. 